Hi, this is Mohammed Shakil here and uh, in this tutorial series you'll be working with the rack and pinion mechanism. You'll be creating rack and pinion mechanism uh, each and every part of it and uh, assembling it together and finally you'll be working with the DMU Kinematics Workbench. So I highly recommend that you go through my previous tutorial and once you reach at this particular stage, right here you have the simulation, create simulation option. So a lot of users uh, face problem while inserting uh, uh, inserting points in the simulation bar. So basically what you can do in this uh, at this particular point, I'll start from the beginning, that is insert simulation and uh, click on the mechanism, click OK and uh, once you're at this stage what you can do, you can move your slider to one particular point here and insert the first point and once that is done click on the backward button over here and as you can see here by default uh, this particular uh, position is being created so you can delete it and then you can move it towards this particular position right here and give an insert and once that is done you can play you can what you can do the speed is too high so you can reduce the speed and you can see uh, that the simulation works perfectly so basically you have the option of uh, reducing and increasing the uh, interpolation steps here so uh, and you have uh, an option to repeat the loop and few more options are there uh, which I'll be discussing in detail when I'll uh, discuss about simulation uh, part completely so I'll be uploading a tutorial based on this very soon so keep watching stay tuned subscribe me like my videos ask me doubts thank you so much for watching